Hello and welcome to your Astrological Vibrations for Tuesday, June 15th, 2021 by Gaia Cleaning. I am Mimi and our energy mantra for today is find the balance between listening and speaking. And today I don't have too, too much going on, but as soon as I look at the astro energy, um, the lyrics express yourself, don't repress yourself came up, came to mind. So we have two energies that are dealing with that today. The first is a connection between the sun and the moon. So the sun in Gemini, moon in Leo. Moon in Leo already brings that express yourself energy, but communication is one of the themes of Gemini energy. Now what came to mind with this, well actually let me, let me, let me go into this other transit and then, then we will go there. The other transit that we have is we actually have Mercury going retrograde, not going retrograde, it's already retrograding, in case you haven't experienced it. It is retrograde. <laughs> Mercury retrograde conjunct Lilith energy. So here we go. What came to mind is how many times, just tuning in for today as part of the lesson, lesson of the day, tuning in how many times you don't speak your mind for better or for worse because I think sometimes not everything is meant to be said and spoken into the world. However, I think my phone's ringing, the universe is agreeing with me. And yet I think other times we hold things back that we are meant to speak or are called to speak up. Now this, this is showing us in two layers part of that energy, part of that layer is that moon in Leo bringing up the inner child. How many times were you silenced as a, as a child when you had something important or profound or on point to say? I was definitely that child. Sagittarius has that tendency um, at the Gemini rising and I was like, yeah, this is what I think <laughs> um, and got myself in trouble often to the point that I found myself very shut down another time in my life. So tune into that inner child. It, are there parts of your inner child that are still repressed because of that on point energy? And are there things that you need to speak? The other piece is that Lilith piece, Lilith working with Mercury retrograde. So Lilith energy, again, is a part of this world that has been very shut down. People didn't want to hear what Lilith had to say, her observations, that energy, because she was so aligned and it's very hard to hear something that's soul aligned when you yourself are not. And so for so much of this world, there has been so much pushing against the soul that I think it's made it hard for the Lilith energies to always speak. So between these two aspects, we may find ourselves having something to say. Now, this doesn't mean you have to speak it out loud. Maybe it's in a journal. Maybe it's through artistic expression. There are many ways you can express yourself, not repress yourself. That is absolutely the energy today. Now, besides those two connections, we are having some lazy lion energy as the moon goes void, of course, in Leo, not to shift into Virgo until 8 p.m. Pacific time. So nice, long void moon, void moon energy in Leo. I do want to mention that we are going to be in that build up into um, an inconjunct with Pluto between the sun and Pluto. So that also may bring up some repressed stuff. So just keep that in mind through the day. Again, this doesn't necessarily Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Mercury retrograde. These things don't necessarily need to be said out loud, but whether it's to a friend or somebody you trust, or written in your journal or expressed, there is a call for withheld expression to be expressed today. Now, I should mention in the cards, I have a thunderbolt. This could bring up some challenges. You may have to face some challenges within yourself. But I also have the tuning in card and the guidance card in reverse. So really take a moment, like go be deeper with yourself. Go be present with yourself. Listen to your higher guidance. Don't just, don't just run willy nilly with this because 
Our words are important. The words we speak to ourselves, to others, they are important. There is a balance to this. Today is about finding what that balance is, but recognizing where you tip the balance in that withheld energy. So just be aware of that. But what is to come? Beautiful things. The completion card, that's the world card. So really beautiful things can come of this if you approach it with your consciousness. So I'm going to leave that here. Hopefully I will get the classroom up tomorrow. I was hoping today, but unpacking took some precedence. So that is it for today. You can book a reading with me. Email me, mimiclark at gmail.com. Besides that, the better it gets, the better it gets. There's more than enough love in the world for you. You have the power and stay curious.